Warning, do not sit here. What happens if I do? Oh, now I'm a fossil. Well, a skeleton. They've got the pelvis right, I think. The skull could do with a bit of work, but never mind. I don't think they were going for accuracy with this. Oh yeah, I meant to warn you not to step on that place. <laughs> like a factory. Okay, that was actually pretty funny. Uh, T-Rex says, help your community fight the coronavirus. Uh, very true, keep on fighting the coronaviruses. Uh, yeah, my cat agrees. What do you want? You've been fed. Oh, this music is grating now. Wash your hands regularly, use soap and wash for at least 20 seconds. Avoid touching your face, yes we know it's really hard to do. Well it would be good at not touching its face. Could it reach its face? I don't know if it could. Uh, someone in the comments, can T-Rex actually touch its own face? Would it do it with like its rear leg? Did Archosaurs like scratch themselves? Is answer, uh, the question that I don't know the answer to. Run out of time. I think this is how the game should be played. Right, run. All of this curatorial work that's gone into it just destroyed. Okay, this is pretty fun. I just love hitting stuff with my head. My big T-Rex head. We never saw this crabby boy. We didn't talk about the snail. Okay, well, it's gone. What is the biggest snail in the fossil record? That is a good question. I know that at... Um, is it Blackberry Hill in the Cambrian? They have uh, terrestrial fossils that look like tyre marks of a, a motorbike all over a bedding planes and they think that if I'm right in thinking, someone's going to have to check this, that they are from a, a gastropod potentially, like a huge gastropod in the Cambrian that was crawling around on land that's awesome alright, okay, so we are now Plant fossils? Oh god. Well... <laughs> Every time I try and get closer, knock... Okay, ammonites, presumably. Could also be gastropods. Could be huge forearms. I've got a feeling that if I... press enter... another audio track of the theme tune comes in. That is correct. Oh god. What a treat for the ears. Aren't you glad you tuned in today? Right, ichnology. Dinosaur footprint. Theropod footprint. Some starfish. And is that horseshoe crab? Yes, it is. The fossil chelicerates are really well represented in this game. That's wonderful. Like, and to think that somewhere someone has made, taken the time to create a fossil horseshoe crab, uh, presumably for this game, but potentially in others as well. I don't know. Okay, that could have been a brachiopod or a plant fossil. I'm not, in, I'm not a paleobotanist, but that looks like it is probably some angiosperm. Is that a feather? Oh, it's just floating in the air now. Or is it like some glossopteris kind of leaf? 
I'm so old, I know what to do with a cassette tape and a pencil. Yes, I do. Oh, look at that magic horseshoe crab. Kind of looks like Lunataspis or something. That's the oldest fossil horseshoe crab from the Ordovician. That's many nights at the museum. That was satisfying. So I think we've done all the paleo. Some American red party cups. So whilst we do deep time, uh, not too hot on my more recent Alien, uh, history. Whoa, what's this? Is this one the grail? I think it's just the it. Oh no, there it is. Okay, now we've at it. That's probably the one and only time we're going to see a, a representation of Jesus in one of these games. Get out of here. <gasps> I love that picture of a cat. When they couldn't figure out how to draw a cat, so it's just like a human face. <laughs> if I get reincarnated... Can I do something with this? Axe throwing. Okay, got the axe. Now, how do I throw it? Well, I tried. It's like Excalibur. Oh, yes. Although I am stuck in a cube. <laughs> I like how the uh, music changes with the rooms. Can I destroy the... Oh, yes! What on earth is that? Some evil goat statue. Might be nice to get an Egyptologist in. See what they make of these uh, models. See what uh, he or she uh, thinks about this. Like, why are they getting all of these... Egyptian models from. They must have like got them as free elements in to download and put into the game. Cause those are pretty fancy, you know? They look like they've been properly made. Is that Anubis? I'd rather see an old bis. Since hair isn't preserved in fossils, we can't rule out the possibility that dinosaurs looked like this. Very good. Since fossils aren't preserved in hair, which is also true, we can't rule out the possibility that some dinosaurs lived like this. It'd be very hard to prove. Next room. Okay, we're back at the start. Well, what do you even make of a game like that? It was fun for the one hour that I played it. Uh, but then it's free, so give it a go. See if you can complete it. See what you make of the museum. And yeah, if you like this video, if you want to see more weird stuff that we find, let us know. If you want to see only the serious stuff, let us know. If you like this content, then please make sure that you subscribe because only about 20% of people do or something like that, if that. So make a huge difference to the channel if you did. Uh, Leave a like, subscribe, share, like, and subscribe again, and like again, and follow us on social media.